you are, Chiori! Uh huh? Uh, how did you know where I... Ah... Uh, Iloth told you, didn't she? She did. We were just looking for you at the shop and Leticia was there. She wanted to thank you for the dress. So, you see? You don't have to be sad. We'll figure out how to get through this together. Uh, I'm not upset. I just wanted to get some fresh air. Wanna sit here with me? The view's quite stunning. Don't worry. I'll catch you if you fall. Alright, don't mind if we do! Well, how does it feel? This place is pretty great. Right? It's quiet and open, and far from the relentless critique from fashion commentators in the media. <sighs> it's just you and the beautiful scenery. Yeah, it's important to take yourself out of that kind of stressful environment every once in a while. <laughs> I didn't grow up in a very strict family. My parents would joke that I grew up to be so assertive because they spoiled me as a child. I would get together with the other children to climb trees and explore caves. One time, I even climbed over the walls of the Kamisato estate. One of the servants had to physically remove me. Whoa, Paimon would have never imagined that! But even as rambunctious as I was, when it came to needlework, I was as quiet and focused as could be. It was as if I discovered a whole new world within those vibrant, dazzling fabrics. You know the feeling? Uh, sorta. My parents noticed, and they sent me to study under a famous Inazuman tailor. It wasn't long before I had driven away pretty much every master tailor on the archipelago. You could say I really tried their patience. You were that misbehaved? I wasn't misbehaved, exactly. I just... Often had strange ideas when it came to fashion. Ones that weren't in line with traditional ways of doing things. On top of that, ugh, I hated the idea of groveling and making outfits for every arrogant big shot expecting me to be at their beck and call. Anyway, a few incidents later, I soon found myself without a master. Worse, not one shop was willing to hire me. Not even to do grunt work. No wonder you left Inazuma. I was angry and frustrated. So, before I left, I swore to all those masters that my brand would one day become renowned all over to that. <laughs> 